Welcome to Team Wild's Air Power, the world's biggest and best air gun show on the web. This week, I'm back in the Texan Outback, armed once again with the awesome Benjamin Rogue 357 Big Bore Air Rifle. As I stalk through the brush, the sun is low in the sky and the shadows are lengthening. It's getting late in the day and I'm on the lookout for a sheep. But this time, I'm on the hunt for something a little bit different. A Mouflon Cross Texas Doll Sheep. As I'm sure you know, here at Team Wild TV, we've hunted Mouflon in a variety of places. We took a beautiful trophy Mouflon Ram at Count Leonard Colorado Mansfield's magnificent Apochno estate in the Czech Republic with the awesome Merkel RX Helix. We've also taken a nice ram in Hungary with the guys at Wonderheart using my Ruger M77 Hawkeye. Mouflon are the most travelled sheep in Europe, but today we're on a hunt on the other side of the pond. This time we're using an air rifle, a big bore behemoth of a gun that by now you should be very familiar with the Benjamin Road 357. There's a surprisingly large selection of exotic animals in Texas. Game ranchers have brought across a variety of animals from all corners of the globe over the past century, which means that now you can find almost anything here. The Texas Hunt Lodge have an abundance of trophy sheep on their game ranch, and we've helped them out with plenty of management jobs of late using the Benjamin Rogue to take out their problem animals quietly and efficiently. This time, I've been called upon to take a hybrid Mouflon Cross Texas style sheep. I use the sparse trees for cover and get into a great position for a shot. I set my sights on him. But a herd of sheep cross his path and block my shot. Then he goes to make a move, so I take a chance, give him a call, and he stops. I make a good shot, but he tries to bolt. Despite the fight in the old boy, he hasn't gone far. Another quick, clean, efficient kill from the Benjamin Rogue. Now he's gone down from the Benjamin Rogue 357. Once again, clean off his feet. Walked. So the original shot was 42 yards and he's now lying 63 yards uh, so he's run back 21 yards you saw him go down scrabble for a little bit but it was all over hopefully he's going to taste as good as he looks so he stopped moving now let's go have a look i move in to claim my quarry and he's definitely a goner now this is a pretty, pretty ram. Now as you can see, he's got a beautiful white underbody there, lovely brown and black coat. And look at that, a very, very handsome spread. Now, I've done a lot of work here, taking out broken horn rams and sick uh, deer and all manner of other things. So it's nice to actually be able to shoot uh, a decent animal that's in pretty good shape. Now, they want to thin the numbers of sheep out on this property. They do shoot them quite a lot. So they tend to do that with a yellow and infirm. 
but luckily for me they also had one of these that needed taken out as well so really really pleased but a very very handsome animal really hardy these are tough conditions out here so an animal that can cope out here and actually thrive and multiply in the ways these do uh, you know i take my hat off to them but once again as you saw phenomenal performance from the benjamin 357 rogue and those 145 grain nosler built uh, benjamin extreme bullets these guys know how to build air guns. Now, I've had lots of people saying it won't work or you can't shoot that with an air gun or it's not possible. Well, boys and girls, yes it is. Perfect shot placement is the key, but once you get that bullet where it needs to be, it has devastating terminal performance. So, another great hunt, another great performance from the Benjamin, and now I deserve a pint. To find out more about the Benjamin Rogue, visit crossman.com. Subscribe to Team Wild TV for the best hunting, air gun, gear and bow hunting videos on YouTube.